At the start of turn one, all countries are at peace with one another. Prior to their submission of their setup and turn one moves, Prussia issued a public announcement. For weeks, my diplomats have tried to get Austria to address our grievances surrounding the conditions under which the secession of Maria Theresa to the Austrian throne was achieved. Whereas other kingdoms received money, land, and military assistance, Prussia received naught but the threats to sign the Sanctio Pragmatica, or else. We have pressed for a diplomatic resolution to this sorry treatment of a court and kingdom that has ever been a steadfast ally to Austria, but to no avail. All our overtures have gone unanswered, ignored. Therefore, it saddens the court of Prussia to say, if the Austrian court does not come to the table in good faith and negotiate a fair settlement for the continued Prussian support of the Sanctio Pragmatica, then we will be forced to resort to military means to restore and maintain our honor. After all of the turns and moves were submitted, the group worked on plotting the movement on the game map. All movement is considered to be occurring simultaneously. Those countries who issued public announcements were allowed to read them at this time. Austria moves 7 SPs from Bohemia to Bavaria, 6 SPs from Austria to Venetia, and 6 SPs from the Netherlands to Westphalia. Austria built 2 SPs in the Netherlands and 2 SPs in Bohemia. As rightful ruler of Austria and one of the principal protectors of the Holy Roman Empire, Austria will consider anyone invading the territories of Westphalia, Hesse, Berg, Franconia, Palatinate, Baten, or Württemberg as enemies, and will come to the aid of those countries with the full force of the Austrian military. England moved 5 SPs from Bengal to the Marathas and 3 SPs from the Eastern Atlantic to Ireland. England built 2 SPs in Bengal and 1 SP in Scotland. France moved 10 SP from southern France to Savoy, 3 SP from the Mediterranean to Sicily, and 4 SP from Mysore to Travancore. France builds 1 SP in northern France, 1 in lower Canada, and 1 in Mysore. Prussia moves 20 SP from Prussia into Silesia. Prussia builds 3 SP in Saxony. Russia moves 3 SP from North Central Russia to Lithuania, 3 from Northern Russia to Livonia, 3 from Northern Russia to Kurland, and 6 from Southern Ukraine to Bukovina. Russia builds 1 SP in Southern Ukraine. The countries of Russia and Austria have concluded a mutual protection agreement with regards to the Ottoman Empire. Should the Ottomans attack either country, the other will enter the war in support. Sweden moves 8 SP from Sweden to Norway. Sweden builds 1 SP in Sweden. The Ottomans move 3 SPs from Albania, 3 from Montenegro into Bosnia, and 6 SPs from Turkey to Azerbaijan. The Ottomans build 1 SP in Bessarabia and 1 in Yedisan. Instead of fighting a battle in Silesia, Austria decides to retreat its 1 SP into Austria. Unfortunately, during the retreat fire, that SP was lost. Countries attacking a neutral territory have the combat determined by a die roll. The roll can be modified based upon the size of the attacking force in relation to the EP value of the territory. The greater the ratio, the greater the bonus. While poor rolls can result in a failure to capture the territory, or a loss of SP when capturing it, good rolls might allow SP from the territory to join the player's army. Austria secures Venetia and gains 1 SP. Austria secures Bavaria and secures Westphalia. England secures Ireland and captures the Marathas. Marathas gives them 1 SP. France secures Savoy and gives them 2 SP. Securing Sicily gaining 1 SP and capturing Travancore gaining 1 SP. Russia secures Lithuania secures Livonia getting 1 SP and secures Kurland. Russia captures Bukovina gaining 1 SP. Sweden secures Norway gaining 1 SP. The Ottomans uh, capture Bosnia gains 1 SP and captures Azerbaijan. 
The end of turn one finds the spark of war on the European continent. Prussia found itself with a huge territorial gain in wresting Silesia away from Austria, all the while incurring no losses. Prussia did draw first blood in the conflict when they destroyed the single SP garrison unit while it was attempting to retreat back into Austria. Austria, for their part, took a big hit in losing Silesia, but ultimately came out ahead with their advances into Italy, Bavaria, as well as moving troops into Westphalia to protect the interests of the Holy Roman Empire. England moved into Ireland to gain Irish support and money, while France moved into Italy to secure the traditionally Bourbon territories. Both did their part to place the subcontinent under continental rule. Sweden secured the Nordic Peninsula, and the Ottomans made conservative movements both east and west. And Russia moved into Poland in order to strengthen the Polish and Russian alliance, while moving into the Slavic territories along the Ottoman border. The turn ends with Austria and Prussia at war with one another, and the remaining countries jockeying for position for the eventual war that will consume everyone. At the conclusion of turn one, the territorial counts are as follows. Austria has 24 economic points, England 25, France 24, Prussia 20, Russia 16, Sweden 7, and Turkey 18. The start of turn two yields the following random events. The Netherlands succumb to disease, as well as Prussia. The Ottomans must pay seven tricorn against the Persians, and the Jacobites are not rebelling. Austria collects 22 tricorn, England 25 tricorn, France 24 tricorn, Prussia 10 tricorn, Russia 16 tricorn, Sweden 7 tricorn, and the Ottomans 11 tricorn.